Welcome to another edition of Weapons Wednesday here at the Rock Island Arsenal Museum. Today we're going to highlight the U.S. Model 1863 Lindsay Rifle. This is actually a very unique weapon in the fact that it features two hammers, as you can see above me. Um, the idea is that this rifle would actually be double charged, so one charge in the barrel sitting on top of the other. The right hand hammer would fall first when the trigger was pulled halfway back. The left hand hammer would fall second. Um, igniting the second charge. The idea is that you could get two shots out of a single barrel in lieu of your traditional one-shot musket. Uh, this weapon did not perform well in the field. It was actually only issued to one regiment. That was the 16th Michigan uh, Volunteer Infantry. Uh, it saw action at one one battle, and that was the Battle of Peebles Farm in Virginia. Uh, the after-action report was uh, actually quite poor on the weapon. Uh, in the heat of battle, uh, soldiers regularly yanked back, going through both cycles of the hammers and firing both rounds. Um, that that actually caused a severe amount of damage to the firearm. Um, this is actually best known in the firearms community as one of the poorest designed weapons of the American Civil War. If you'd like to learn more about the Lindsay, uh, please visit the Rock Island Arsenal Museum. We're open Tuesday through Saturday, noon to 4.